Chris Weidman. Or Glover to Shearer. Chris Weidman. Here we go. Fight scheduled for three five minute rounds. White trucks to White. Black trucks for Teixeira. Glover Teixeira is a very well rounded fighter. He has excellent stand up, knockout power in his hands, a high level. Oh, he's rocked here early. Hard straight punch. And whoa! knockout here early in the first. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. And here in the replay we see this huge left hand landing for the knockout. Let's see it one more time from a different angle. Look at the power in this. Here is Bruce It's a heavyweight showcase between Antonio, Bigfoot Silva, and the former Pride champion, the Croatian, Merko Krota. Oh! Antonio Silva. Ready to fight. Merko nice. Krota. Here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Black trunks for Krota. White trunks for Bigfoot Silva. Antonio Bigfoot Silva is a huge heavyweight, has an outstanding ground game, wicked ground and pound, and some serious knockout power in his hands. Man, he gets some torque on that. These guys are going at it here right away, trading blows. Whoa! Boy, he is in big trouble, Mike. Hard straight punch. Nice combination. Swing and a miss. Oh, oh big hand kick. Hand jump. Oh, did he snap that kick? Oh, head kick. And again. Whoa! Oh! And it is all over. Excellent timing here. Big left hand for the victory. Once again, here's our fight replay. As we can see here in the replay, this is the shoot. And here we go with the official to sit. Coming up next, it's a featherweight matchup between Penn and Burrell and one of the best in the world, Demetrius. Mighty Mouse Johnson. Oh! Head and brow. Demetrius Johnson. Here we go. Three round fight. Head and brow is really going to enjoy a huge reach advantage in tonight's fight. Having a huge reach advantage is absolutely a gigantic asset in a mixed martial arts fight. You can connect strikes at a distance where your opponent can't touch you. Oh, he tagged him with that straight. They're going after it quick here. Good one, two by Barat. Excellent job of landing punches here. Great takedown defense right there. Very nicely done. Really good movement on the ground. There's a big left hand. Moves to full guard. Rocked him with that right hand. Brown gets it back to guard. He's now working from half guard. Good shot to the head. Brown gets it back to the guard. He's looking to stay busy on the ground. He passes again into half guard. Just over three now. Joe, he's showcasing some great movement on the ground. Oh, good left hand. Johnson with a solid leg kick. He lands an excellent combination. Big kick misses. Joe, that was a brutal knee to the body. Hard 
jab. Oh, and another jab. Big combination. Whoa! So oh, he's home. Powerful left hand. He caught him with the head kick. Big straight punch. I like that, Mike. I like how he's mixing it up. Oh, big body kick. Man, he just missed. Oh, Huge right big right hand. hand. Hard straight punch. Oh. Nice. Oh. oh, he hurt him. Vicious hammer fist. Oh, big shot from the top. Punches and punches. He wants to finish. Oh, he sweeps. Look at his position now. He's got the full mount, Joe. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. defense against the hammer fist. Nice right hand. Wow! They are on their feet! Round two. Big straight punch. Powerful kick. Hurt him with that right. Oh, he's landed some good shots here. Big left hand. Wow! Wow, he is getting off some massive kick. He is in big trouble here. advantage or his distance to the best of his abilities head kick nicely done his left eye is really starting to swell here good jab back and forth now kick to the body big right hand nice takedown he has a huge elbow to the head he finish it here Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Now he's and there's a big takedown. Final 10 seconds of round two. Into the round. And that was a huge takedown that will score points. Ready to fight? Ready. Five minutes remains in the fight. At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. He's going to look to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. Oh. Solid straight punch. Nice kicks. 
late on his feet. The jab connects. Looking for the suplex. Great movement on the ground. a solid elbow. <laughs> Trying to take the back here. He blocks that hammer fist. Three minutes remain in this fight. And he connects. Gross pass to He parries the kick away. Great jab by Johnson. And he scores a single leg takedown. He hip escapes from the full mount. Side control. Vision has to have become a concern because both of his eyes are starting to swell very badly now. Burrell with a good punch. That's a solid leg kick. What a crazy fight. Oh! Wow! Oh, ah! he's hurt! That one dropped him! Big oh! right hand! Looking to take the back. Oh, that one hurt him. Big Ooh, right hand. Big right hand. Let's see what he can do from here. And this fight. one goes the distance. Joe, that was an outstanding fight. Demetrius Johnson's ability to drop his opponent repeatedly over the course of this fight and the effect of striking that went along with it should get him the decision win here tonight. I absolutely agree. Several knockdowns, brutal strikes landed. Clearly, he's the victor. Round three, the legs buckle, and he's down. We have our official decision. a heavyweight collision between Fabricio Verdun and Derek the Black Beast Lewis. I am riding Our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Lewis is 31. Verdun is 38. Fabricio Verdun. Derek Lewis. Here we go. Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. The first thing that comes to mind, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. Yeah, one of the very best Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu practitioners to ever enter into mixed martial arts. Look how quick his counters are. Man, he just slipped that right. Inside leg kick. Oh! Big shot. Oh! What an exchange! And again he connects. Good knee. Wow. Oh, he landed an uppercut. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. Head kick. Body kick, look at that.
Joe, he's really on point with his strikes tonight. Knee to the midsection. Both men landing in that exchange. Good defense, and he counters with a jab. He's finding his rhythm here early in the round. Verdun with a good jab. Oh, he caught him. Good takedown defense. And he's going to try to take the back. His opponent's got his back here. Looking for the rear naked choke. Looks like he's got it now. He rolls on. He's got it under the chin now. He's trying to go palm to palm. That's a deep choke. It's getting tighter. He may have to tap. That's it. It is all over. Wow. Fabrizio Verdun, winner by submission. Use great technique to get the choke and get the win. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. And let's see this one more time. A classic rear naked choke. Bruce Buffer has the decision. And Hapio Sapo Guitar. Or Nick Diaz. You ready to fight? Hapio Guitar. Here we go. Our fight tonight is scheduled for three five minute rounds. Nick Diaz can do it all. But one of the things to really look out for with his stand up is his left hook. Welcome to the jungle. Joe, we're seeing some nice work. He's really staying busy. Natal with the jab. Great utilization of the jab. Oh, he's taking some punishment here early, Joe. Beautiful combination. Strong wow. jab. Oh, he rocked him. He's oh, out cold. My, just like that. Beautiful KO for the victory early in the first. Time now for our fight replay. As we can see here in the replay, this is the huge overhand punch that shut the lights out. Let's take one more look at this. Oh, Bruce Buffer has the official decision. No, no, no. It's a welterweight showcase between Don Cowboy Cerrone and former Strike Force champion Gilbert Melendez. Our tail. Donald Cerrone. Gilbert Melendez. Here we go. Fight scheduled for three five minute rounds. White trunks for Melendez. Black trunks for Cerrone. Donald Cerrone's use of the knee, both in an offensive and a defensive way, is some of the best in the entire lightweight division. Nice jab by Melendez. They have started this fight off with a brawl. He was looking for the head kick, but it was blocked. And there's a nice straight by Cerrone. Joins the things that are the key to this striking. Trying to close the distance. Goes for a single. Big kick just missed. Nice shot. Oh, look at that. Big shot. He connects with the left. Hard straight punch. Oh, combination. He's in a lot of trouble. Big punch. He oh, lands the left huge hand. left. He connects with the head kick. Man, he goes down. Wow, he is throwing some huge kicks here. Under three. Melendez gets him in the plum. And a good knee. knee. Oh, he missed. 
missed that kick. The one two by Melendez. Great exchanges. The huge head kick is blocked. Nice work on the count. Joe, that's an outstanding tight knee. He's really mixing things up tonight. Head kick. Nice combination. Beautiful job by Cerrone and mixing it up there. That's another big head kick, Joe. I don't know how many more is a to take. Head kick. Vicious combinations. Head kick. Cerrone, the victor. Wow. What a statement that man just made. Victory by knockout. Roundhouse kick to the head. Time now for our fight replay. Let's take another look at the huge roundhouse kick that ended this fight. As soon as it lands, this contest is over. Here we see it from another camera angle. Bruce Buffer with the... It's a lightweight bout between Frank, the answer Edgar, and vicious striker, Edson Barboza. Our tip, Frankie Edgar, Edson Ready. Barboza. Here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White chops for Barboza. Black chops for Edgar. In tonight's fight. Keeping his opponent at the end of his strikes. And oh, he caught him early. He's a hard to shot with the left. Big straight punch. Oh, that's a good shot. Beautiful strike here to end the fight early in the first. Let's check out the action. Bruce Buffer has... Coming up next, it's a featherweight matchup between Yair Rodriguez and Team Alpha Male's Chad Mendez. Yair Rodriguez. You ready to fight? Chad Mendez. Ready. And oh. here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Black trunks for Mendez. White trunks for Rodriguez. Chad Mendez is an outstanding athlete, has one-punch knockout power, and very good wrestling as well. Both men looking <laughs> to do damage early. Mendez with a good knee to the body. He tries to take him down with the single, but can't get it. He missed that kick. Superman punch. Joey did a nice job blocking that punch. Rodriguez with a straight to the body. Wow! Trying to stay out of trouble here. Oh, head kick. With the kick. Oh, and he eats a shot. Oh, and he lands the head kick. And a big elbow, Joe. Just over three now. And they disengage from the clinch. Beautiful counter. Head kick. Very nice kicks. Joe, his opponent, clearly wants this fight on the ground. But he's done a great job stuffing those takedown attempts. Fainting. Look at that eye, man. That is... Wow, that's a big head kick. The kick lands and he's down. Oh, oh big right hand. That right hand. Oh, he's hit. That's it. That's it. The fight is it over. It is all over. 
It was some brutal ground and pound that led to the end of this fight. Once again, here's our fight replay. Let's take one more look at the end of the fight here. This is a... With the official decision, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called us out to this contest. Coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Big Ben Rockwell and Boss El Guapo Ruben. Ben Rothwell, Boss Root. Here we go! Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Big Ben Rothwell is a massive heavyweight with serious knockout power and an excellent ground game as well. Nice job keeping those hands busy. Rothwell with the good left. These guys are going at it here right away, trading blows. Rothwell counters with the right jab. He's doing a great job of mixing things up here, keeping it unpredictable. That huge head kick was blocked. Root with a good jab. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. Good left hand. And he connects here. Good job blocking the punch. Nicely done. He is really finding his range with that uppercut. All right on that one. He's finding his rhythm here early in the round. Oh, huge kick to the midsection. Oh! Man, that was a big strike. He heard him. Looking to finish the fight. Solid jab. Powerful right hand. Big takedown. Tries to pass here, but gets shut down. Works the double underhooks here. Rothwell gets him in the plum. And he pulls away. Rothwell with the good left. Nice. Nice one, too. Good straight to the bottom. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. He connects with the straight. He's doing a really good job of timing the shots. I think he's looking to set up that uppercut again. Good block. Trying to take him down again. That left misses. Knee to the body. Good connection with the straight by Rockwell. Joe, that was a nice transition. Now we're back and over under. One minute on the clock here in the first. He's got some time. Looking for the choke. He drops down for it. This is nasty. This is really tight, Mike. I think this is it. Oh, he escaped. Very nice escape. Full guard now. Rothwell gets caught by that right. Nice combination of strikes from the full guard. Round oh. one is in the books. Ready to fight? Ready. Ready. Round two. Now starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's going to want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. There's the jab. Good slip by Root. Oh, there he connected. He's doing a real good job of landing those punches. He scores with a nasty inside leg kick. Joe, look inside the numbers. Significant strikes landing. He's doing a great job of being unpredictable and mixing things up here. Oh, that's a vicious kick. Oh, what an exchange. Hard left hand. Vicious combination. Beautiful body shot there, too. Big head kick lands. Oh, 
nice kick. Oh, oh. combination. Oh, he's landing at will. Big shot. Oh, that hook did damage. Nice block, and he counters with the jab. He lands a head kick. Oh, stunning jab. Hard straight punch. Oh, he left. Good combination. Big shots. Vicious shots in the body. Great head kick. Oh, Joe, another strong jab. Big straight punch. One overhook, one underhook. Rupin's got double underhook. And he's taken down by Rupin. He's going to try to take the back, I think. Rothwell's looking for a choke. Break the grip. Won the fight by armbar. Beautiful job. Joe, here's the finish. Bruce Buffer. Hat. Coming up next, it's a light heavyweight showcase between Jim Kennedy and the longtime middleweight champion, Anderson. The Spider Silva. Our Tim, Tim Kennedy. You ready to fight? Anderson ready. Silva. Here go. we go. Fight scheduled for three five minute rounds. White trucks for Silva. Black trucks for Kennedy. Anderson Silva, devastating striker. One weapon to look out for in this fight is his left hook. Very nice jab by Anderson Silva. Good job of timing this combination of strikes here. Slips and rips. Failed attempt. He's got him hurt. Oh, look at this. Who saw that coming? Knockout here early in the first. Time now for our fight replay. Let's see if we get a better look at that from this angle. Let's see that again. Oh man. KO. Here is Bruce Buff. Heavyweight showcase between Mauricio, Shogun Hua, and the Karate Kid, Lyoto Machida. Oh! Mauricio, Shogun Hua, Lyoto Machida. And here we go. The light heavyweight belt is on the Five five minute rounds. White trunks for Machida. Black trunks for the champion. Mauricio Shogun Hua has a lot of weapons in his arsenal. He's particularly fond of the overhand right. Keep an eye out for it. Combination by the champion. They're going after it quick here. Trying to go to the body. Big power from the cheetah. One of the most unorthodox strikers we have ever seen. Vicious kick to the body by Leota. Shogun with a solid one-two. And that jab's really effective. Top of the kick. Whoa! High kick. He 
And he's getting rocked here early. He's in big, big trouble. Nice jab. He's looking to pass here, Joe. Half guard. Punch and landed. Oh, head kick. Hard straight punch. Big punches. Oh, oh. What an exchange. That is huge. Right hand. Right hand. That's oh, a big uppercut. uppercut. He just landed. Solid right hand. Combination. Oh, solid jam. He got rocked oh, with a left hand. Left hand. that shot to the body. Big roundhouse kick. Clean hook. A ton of quickness possessed by both of these men. Looking for that head kick. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. Really missed with that right hand. Looking for the takedown. Wants the single. Joe, that was well done, blocking the punch. Good body punch there. Shogun with a nice punch. Round oh, one comes to a close. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go, round two. Just like we saw in round two. Oh, he had it. Done it. Hard diving punch. Vicious ground and pound by the challenger. Big right hand clipped him. Oh, some heavy shots from the top. There's a left that connects. You're in half guard. You're all good there. Excellent sweep. Looking for the rear naked choke. He's got a full rear in. naked. That is just amazing technique. And he's free. Beautiful escape. That was a close rear naked choke. Side control. Nicely done. Closing the distance. He's got the clinch, Joe. He's got the double underhooks. Back to over under control. And they move out of the clinch. Leona Wichita is continuing to target that cut. He certainly is. He's absolutely targeting that cut, and that is going to open up even wider now. Strong counter kick to the body by the Cheetah. They are exchanging here, Mike. And there he goes. Good jab by Machida. Nice hands. Machida's eyes looking really swollen now. You've got to wonder whether or not it's actually a fractured orbit. Nice jab. You can hear that one. Blocked. Good defense, and he counters with a jab. I like how he mixes that up, Mike. I, I just think that there's so many more options. Machida with the takedown. Don't forget, Joe. He's not just a black belt in karate. He's a black belt in jiu-jitsu as well. Big body punch. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground.
20 seconds left. Great job blocking the knee. And he's in the Muay Thai clinch. They have fought for 10 minutes. That's the end of round number two. Joe, that cut is looking worse. Mauricio Shogun's bleeding from his nose. That's a nasty thing to happen because when your nose is bleeding like that, you start opening up your mouth, and that leaves you susceptible to getting knocked out. And here we see some beautiful submission offense here. Let's see it again. And let's take a closer look at that from a different angle. You ready to fight? Ready. Cool. And we are set for the start of round three. This is a championship fight. So it is scheduled for five. He pushes the body shot away. Hua starting to bleed bad now, Mike. Left hand. Very nice. Oh, and a big left hand by Machida. The older Machida, of course, a long time karate black belt. But, Joe, I think many times people overlook how powerful Machida can be. I mean, the finish of Rashad Evans and the finish of Ryan Bader were two of the best in UFC history. Continuing to strike well. Nice uppercut by Shogun. Lands a giant kick. Another right hand. that vicious knee. Great trip for the takedown. He slips the punch. Oh! Right into the midsection. Nice body kick. Beautiful body shot there, too. Head kick! Jab. Oh, he's landing. Vicious kick to the body. Oh, very nice. Look at this. Take down. Nice movement on the ground. He postures up. It appears that cut is getting worse. He connects with a big punch from the top. Half guard. One minute remains in round three. Punishing knee to the body from side control. Half guard. There he goes. Back Joe to mount out. again. He hip escapes. He's out of the full mount. And the mount again. Caught him with a punch. Machida's got the full mount again. He scores with punch. a huge left. Uh. Round three in the book. Joe, that cut is looking gross. Shogun Hua is bleeding from his nose. That's a nasty thing to happen because when your nose is bleeding like that, you start opening up your mouth and that leaves you susceptible. You ready to fight? Ready. We begin the championship rounds. This is round four of this title fight. 
Joe, we have made our way to the champion. Oh! Big shot. Trying to finish this fight. Could be it. Big North Huge left. Heard him with that overhand. Slip, slip, counter. Joe, he's been the fighter to control the center of the octagon, keeping his opponent to the outside. Leona Machida is continuing to punish that wounded eye, and you can see that the swelling continues to get worse and worse. He's absolutely targeting that eye. You can clearly see, and he's landing combinations on it repeatedly. And a right behind it. Joe, you can see the effects of those body shots. There's a ton of bruising he's on his right eye. side. Man, he got rocked. This could be it right here. Hard straight punch. Big shots. He is going after him. Oh, that's a big left. Swung everything into that kick, but fell short. Good defense there. Huge hook. Oh, he got robbed. Oh, that one dropped him. Oh, he dives into a huge haymaker. Vicious ground and pound. Beautiful body shot there, too. Hard kick to the head. That's a big right hand. He's teeing off with some vicious shots. Solid straight right by Shoga. Oh, he's going to rock him. He is clearly in big, big trouble here. 20 seconds. Powerful left hand. Back in fourth battle. Uh oh, these are big oh, strikes. Oh, he got run. Oh, oh my oh, goodness. Goodness. Oh, Can my it God. Oh, over. oh, my God. Wow. Wow. Mauricio Shogun Hua by knockout. Man. Beautiful knockout for the KO victory as the round was ending. Time now for our fight replay. And here we see the spectacular knockout that retained his world title. Uncorks this bomb. It lands on the button. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is a wrap. Here it is from another angle. Watch this again here. Lands perfectly. And that's the end. And here he is with the official decision. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at 4 minutes, 48 seconds of round number 4. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed USP heavyweight champion of the world.